there, I'm Bambi, and I'd like to tell you a story about the fun in the forest I used to have when I was about your age. I had lots of good friends. There was Flower the skunk, Hi. Toby the tortoise, no. George the gopher, glad you see you, Wise old the owl, how do you do, charmed I'm sure, the raccoon quadruplets. Hi. 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 You know what quadruplets are, don't you? They're like twins born at the same time, except that there are four of them. The thing about the raccoon quads was that they always were together, one holding onto the other's tail, and so forth. But my best friend of all was Thumper the rabbit. Hi, Bambi. It's real good visiting you again. He was the oldest of the large rabbit family and the smartest. In fact, his mother thought he was just a little too smart because he used to blurt out every thought he had, and you and I know sometimes it's best to keep quiet. When Thumper would say something not too nice, his mother used to sing this little song to him. If you can't say something nice, shh, say nothing. Take a bit of good advice, shh. Say nothing. Think of friendly things to say. That's the path to follow. When you think an unkind thought, button your lips and swallow. <coughs> Once you think it over twice, if you can't say something nice, you won't say anything at all. Shh. If you can't say something nice, shh. Say nothing. Take a bit of good advice, shh. Say nothing. Think of friendly things to say, that's the path to follow. When you think an unkind thought, button your lips and swallow. <coughs> Once you think it over twice, if you can't say something nice, you won't say anything at all. You won't say anything at all. Shh. My story started on a beautiful spring day. It was vacation and the animal children were out of school. I happened to be walking past Thumper's house and I overheard him talking to his mom. Gee, Mom, I don't have anything to do. What's to do all day on this vacation? Then I heard Thumper's mother tell him to go out, find his friends, have a big meeting, and decide some games to play. In a minute, Thumper came jumping out. Hi, Bambi. Hello, Thumper. What you doing? Just walking past your house, wondering what you were doing. I'm not doing anything. Vacations are great, but at least in school you have something to do all the time. Maybe we could call a meeting of all our friends and decide what to do. You know, my mother just said the same thing. Okay, let's find wise old owl and have him gather everybody together. We can meet him on the meadow by the pond. The pond's still got some ice on it. I was down there before breakfast this morning. Well, we can have some fun on the ice. It's so nice on the ice As you glide, glide, glide It's so nice on the ice As you slide, slide, slide Come along, sing this song And away It wasn't long before we found wise old owl perched on a tree limb and still fast asleep. The old guy's still sleeping. I'll wake him up. Maybe we should wait a bit. He's always up all night and needs his rest. But we want to get started on our meeting. He'll be grouchy if we wake him. Yeah, but he'll be mad if we don't. You know how he hates to be left out of anything. 
He always has to take charge. Who, 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 what? Who, who, who was that? Oh, just me, wise old. My voice keeps squeaking on me lately. Oh, I was having such a wonderful dream. I dreamed I was principal of a school. <coughs> that's no dream, that's a nightmare. Thumper, ask him what we want. Oh, yes. Well, wise old, we need your help. We want to call a meeting in the meadow of all our friends. Uh-huh. And what's the purpose of this convocation? What's a... what's a... convocation? It's a meeting. Well, why didn't you say? Thumper, be polite. Well, it's such a nice day and it's vacation. And we don't have anything to do. And so we thought we'd get all our friends together and decide some big event to all do. Very commendable. Uh, good, that is. I'll round everybody up right away, and we can have a spelling bee. Oh, oh, pardon me, Wise Old, but that's too much like school. Well, Wise Old Owl took off immediately and went hoot-hooing through the forest telling everyone the news. And soon the whole gang were in the meadow, all milling around and wondering what was up. Wise old owl finally made himself heard. Quiet, quiet, quiet. Now, may I have your attention, please? I have called this convocation on this beautiful spring day to put into effect a very good idea of mine. That was my idea. Thumper. Well, it was really Bambi's idea. It was really Thumper's mother's idea. But never mind whose idea it was, it's a good one. In any event, we'll start the suggestions with one of mine. I think we should have a spelling bee. No, 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 no that's that. too no, much like no, school. No. Well, it, it seems to me that we should do something useful. Now, the most useful thing I know about is a, is a hole. Uh, the huge symmetrical round hole in the ground. Well, we can all pitch in and I'll, uh, I'll s supervise. <laughs> but to what purpose would it serve? Well, it, it, it would uh, uh, serve the purpose of uh, being pretty. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Oh, no, not, 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 not a bit. I, I think we should all pick flowers. And the one who picks the biggest and prettiest bouquet gets a prize. Oh, flower. Who wants to pick flowers all day? Uh, I think we should have a big race. Did you say a race, Toby? Oh, I sure did. That's what I said. <laughs> oh, that's too much. You gotta be kidding. Look who's suggesting a race, old Slowpoke himself. Uh, you'll be sorry you made fun of old Toby. Yes, you will. We, uh, we could have a race. I could handicap it properly. What's a handicap? Well, it's something you do to somebody in a race to make him not as fast as he really is. Or to give somebody slow a better chance. I don't think much of that idea. Well, it makes it very fair. Since you are the fastest and the champion up to now, we could give you somebody to carry on your back. And we could give the slower ones a big head start. I don't like it. Well, now, let's see. We can call it Thumper's Great Race and paint a big sign for the starting place. So everybody would know it was my race. That's right. That's right. And with a fair-minded, judicious person like myself doing the handicapping, starting, and judging at the finish line, you know all will be fair. I demand a huge head start, since I'll be running underground and may have to excavate some. Well, that's fair. And Mommy told us to stay together. And so I guess we'll have to run together. Yes, yes, all four of you can run as an entry. But you must keep a hold of each other's tails. If we do that, we'll wind up as a circle. Don't you see? No, 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 no. The one in the lead doesn't hold on to a tail. Just numbers two, three, and four. Oh, 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 oh. oh. Flower, your handicap will be to run backwards. Backwards? Yes, yes. That way, you can smell the flowers you've just left. Uh, what's my handicap, wise old? A big head start. 
Since it's my race, I get to pick my own handicap. I'll carry a feather on my back. I don't think that's quite fair, Thumper. I think wise old owls should give everyone their handicap. All right. All right. So, wise old, what are you going to do to me? Well, let me see. I want to be completely fair. We'll give George the gopher and Toby the tortoise head starts. The raccoon quads will run together. Flower will run backwards. Uh, Bambi, you'll have to help me judge. You outclass the rest of these racers. So that takes care of everyone except Thumper. We should assign some weight for his back. We, I know, Thumper, you'll have to carry your little brother. Oh, no, oh, no! Too much weight? No, he's such a pest, but I'll go get him. So off Thumper hippity hop to get his little brother. Hippity hop, hippity hop, hippity hop, hop without stop. Racing around over the ground, hippity 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 hop. I'm just a rabbit and it's a habit chasing all over the place this way. When it's a habit and you're a rabbit, this is the way you find to play. Hippity hop, hippity hop, hippity hop, hop without stop. Racing around over the ground, hippity 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 hop. I'm just a rabbit and it's a habit chasing all over the place this way. When it's a habit and you're a rabbit, this is the way you find to play. Hippity hop, hippity hop, hippity hop, hop without stop. Racing around over the ground, hippity 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 